I'm Mikito Kimishima. I work in a firm, and I live alone. There's a lady whom I have a crush on. Uh, good morning! Kazumi Kazayama lives next to me. She's beautiful, polite, and kind. She's my Miss Wright. Good morning! She used to be, until a few days ago. Bye. But bye She's blunt and cold. Only to me. I don't know why, but from some time ago, she started to keep a distance between me. <sighs> I think it could be a week ago when she started acting cold to me. Heave ho! A week ago? Hmm? It's Kazumi-san. Is she back from shopping? Uh, it's heavy. Um, do you want a hand? But it looks quite heavy. I'm okay. Okay, I can handle this. Nice! Gee! Ah! Uh, see? It got lighter. I can handle this. Uh, uh, I'll go back and bite them again. I'll, I'll go with you. I'm sorry to make you go shopping with me. Ah, uh, not at all. Don't worry. I've been thinking that she's beautiful. I wonder if she has a boyfriend. Oh, why am I so hyper for just being able to go shopping with her? Thank you for today. You're welcome. If you need any help, please let me know. Ooh, ooh, you're very kind. Oh. Thank you. Good night, Mikito-san. Uh, yes, good night. Uh. I'm going to fall in love with her if she smiles at me like this. Well, I guess it's too late. <laughs> she said goodnight. No, no! When I realized I'm thinking about her. Why are you smirking? You're creepy. Uh. Howdy, I'm here. Oh, you're here? Yep. She's my younger sister, Natsuki, who's a college student. Looks like she manages to get in my house. What are you doing here today? Nothing special. I just had nothing to do. You're doting on your brother. You're doting on your sister by immediately giving me the spare key of your apartment when I move into my apartment. I'm worried about you living by yourself. You're doing on your sister. Well, that's not what I want to talk about. Why were you smirking, bro? N no, I wasn't smirking at all. Yes, you were. You had the same look when you first got St. Valentine's Day chocolate in high school. Why does she still remember such a thing? You also got depressed when chocolate was one of the obligatory chocolate distributed to most of the boys in the class. Again, why do you remember such a thing? So, did something good happen? Tell me! No, I won't! Shoot! Well, nothing really happened. I just helped my neighbor shopping, that's all. Morning, bro! In the morning, my sister went to college from my apartment. Oh, morning! You're leaving early. Yep, I have class from the first period. Anyway, she stays at my apartment without any hesitation. Okay, see ya. Yeah, have a nice day. Thanks, love you. All right, all right. Now, I'll start to prepare my breakfast. Oh, Kazumi, good morning. Uh, good morning. Hmm? What do you have in your hands? Huh? just exposing my breakfast to fresh air. I didn't cook too much and I didn't plan to give you a share and came out. Oh, I see. Um, who's that lady? Hmm? Oh, you're talking about Natsuki? He calls her by her first name. She's my family. Family? Yeah. She said that she loves him, so she's her wife. By the way, Kazumi-san, since we met, um... Goodbye. Eh? What? And now I'm here today. When I look back, I still don't understand why Kazumi-san is keeping a distance from me at all. Oh! Uh, hello? Um, can I have a second? What? What do you want? Well, um, it, it looks heavy. Y your shopping bag. No, it's not heavy at all. It's very light. Light like a feather. But, but, uh, I think your hands are shaking. Your voice is also shaking. This is nothing! Thanks! Ah! Ah!
Uh, thank you. No, you're welcome. It's my pleasure. Awkward. No, I shouldn't give up now. I have an opportunity to walk with her like this. I must make a move again. Uh, um... Yes. Um, Kazumi-san, where do you often go out to? To the convenience store. Eh? To the convenience store. Uh, I see. Well, I often go to the convenience store, too. I can imagine. Uh, uh, gosh, I can't keep the conversation going. Uh, um, do you go out somewhere? No, I don't. Like, you know, karaoke, or an amusement arcade, or an amusement park. I don't have anybody who would go out to those places with me. Uh, I can always go out with you, if you don't mind. <laughs> no, thank you. Oh, I see. First of all, there's a partner. Eh? Kazumi-san is a lover? It's easy to imagine. She's so beautiful. Damn it. I look like a fool. What are you thinking? Why are you asking me out when you have a partner? I didn't think that you were such an unfaithful guy. I'd never get involved in a love affair. Hey! Hi, bro. Oh, Natsuki. Are you back from college? Yep. I'm going to stay in your apartment again. Bro? Oh, uh, yeah. She's my younger sister. Whoa! You're so pretty. Are you my brother's girl? Oh, no, I'm not. Oh, too bad. Well, bro... It's not attractive, so he'll never have a girl like you. Unattractive. Natsuki, stop talking nonsense! Well, anyway, I think I'm bothering you two, so I'm just going to leave now. I'm sorry my sister was so rude. Kazumi-san? Uh, no, no, not at all. She wasn't rude. Um... Yeah? Do you have a girlfriend, Mikito-san? Well, uh, I don't. Uh, thanks to Natsuki, she thinks I'm some unattractive poor guy. My likability was increasing, and now it will become lower than before. Is that so? <laughs> anyway, it looks like she has a boyfriend, so I had zero chances in the first place. Um, thank you for today. I'll borrow your reusable bag. It's nothing. You don't have to worry about the bag. Good night. Uh, uh, huh? Well, would you like to come in? Eh? Well, no, thank you. What? Good night. Huh? The next morning. Mm, who is it? It's such an early morning. I'm coming. G good morning. Eh? Hazumi-san, what you doing so early in the morning? Well, actually, I cooked too much breakfast. So can you take it, if you don't mind? Oh... Thank you. Sure, please. And if you don't mind, would you like to eat with me? Uh, thank you for the offer. Uh, I'll have it. Thanks. Eh? Why? <sighs> She's probably thanking me from yesterday. I'm so happy to be able to eat her cooking. But why, ironically, when I decided to give up on her, something good like this happens to me? All right. I'm going to get the groceries for dinner. Huh? Oh, Mikito-san! Are you going out now? Yikes! Kazumi-san came out at the same time. Well, sort of. In the past, I'd be so happy with this situation, but not today. What a coincidence! I'm just going out now. Is that so? Uh, is she going out to do her usual shopping, or is she going out with her boyfriend? Anyway, I better not stand in her way. Okay, bye! Ah, ah, wait! Please wait! Mikato-san! Me too! You're going out now, right? Yeah. From the same apartment! At the same time! Two people are going out! Yeah. Um, so, bye! Bye! Are you in such a hurry? Do you have to go alone? Well, actually, no. Then... Let's go together! You know, I have nothing to do now. Like you said before, I want to go out today. You said before that you'd go out with me. So if you have time today... I think I'd rather not. 
Uh. Maybe her boyfriend doesn't take her out. He might be a busy man or might live far away. I'm glad that she's changed, but since I still have feelings for her, I can't accept her offer. Please wait! D don't you have time? If you are busy, can you spare just a few moments with me? Well, I do have time, but... Then, what's the problem? The problem is that... Huh? She's crying! Why? You, you have time and you're not busy. So does that mean that you don't like me? No, of course not! It's not like that! Then, what is it? Why are you avoiding me so much? Is it because you don't like me? Is it because I was cold to you? No, you're wrong! It's the other way around! Other way? I... well... It's rather embarrassing, but... I'm in love with you, Kazumi-san! Huh? So... If I go out with you, my feelings will get stronger. And... It would be annoying to you, wouldn't it? Uh, annoying? Because you have a boyfriend. Embarrassingly confess my love to her? Uh, <laughs> oh, you're in love with me? Well, that was... Don't you? Was it a lie? No, it wasn't a lie. Uh, <laughs> I can't believe it. You were so cold to me because of a simple misunderstanding. Kazumi-san, you were also cold to me before. It's because I thought you were married. Eh? I thought your sister was your wife. That is... Uh... Okay, Mikoto-san. I think we dispelled our misunderstanding. So will you go out with me on a date? You also had the same misunderstanding and acted cold to me. So that made you like me too. Let's go. W wait. I'd like to clarify that point out. The day after... Howdy, Sister Kazumi. Natsuki-chan, are you going to stay at Mikito-san's place? Yep, are you back from shopping? Yes, we are. I'm going to cook curry for him today. Wow, so sweet. I'm going to cook a lot, so please eat it. Yippee! Actually, the truck ate it all after this. <laughs> <laughs>